right now. This is a gem of a ballpark. Um, it's really important um, that the existing obligation under the lease be funded. The commissioner of Major League Baseball weighing in on future maintenance of the home of the Brewers and who's paying for it. Good evening. Thanks so much for joining us. I'm Jessa Reisbeck. And I'm Mike Stralo and for Natalie Shepard. You saw it live on CBS 58 during the news at 4. Commissioner Rob Manfred addressing the controversy over who should pay for the long-term renovation of AmFam Field. And what happens if the controversy isn't resolved? CBS 58's A.J. Bayatpour live at the ballpark for us tonight with what the commissioner had to say. A.J.? Well, Jessup, my commissioner, Rob Manfred, took questions here on the field for about 10 to 15 minutes. As you might have heard when we dipped in during the 4 o'clock news, almost all of those questions surrounded the future of the Brewers in Wisconsin and who will pay for the repairs the team says is necessary. Here at American Family Field, Commissioner Manfred sounded a lot more confident than local officials currently that there will eventually be a deal involving taxpayer money helping fund those ballpark repairs. The Brewers have said... They estimate that this facility will need more than $400 million worth of work by the time their lease in Milwaukee ends in 2030. Today, the Milwaukee County Board voted unanimously to oppose putting any more county money toward future renovations. They say a state entity runs AmFam Field, so the state should pay for it. Uh, I asked Commissioner Manfred why the public should pay anything after this building was at, built 23 years ago with that five-county sales tax. Manfred indicated the solution will include government aid. There's been a great relationship between ownership here and the governmental bodies, and I'm confident that the governmental bodies will come up um, with a plan to fund what's just an existing obligation under the lease. Uh, Manfred repeatedly said Milwaukee is a great baseball market. At the same time, he did not completely rule out the Brewers being relocated if there are no renovations by the time the lease is up in 2030. The commissioner did note this is a drastically different situation in terms of support from local bodies of government compared to what's going on right now in Oakland where the athletics seem all but certain to be headed to Las Vegas. However, as we stand here in this moment, there is nothing close to resembling an agreement between Governor Evers, Republican leaders in legislature, and local officials at the county and city levels. Reporting live from American Family Field, AJ Byatport, CBS 58 News. When sports and politics come